Hi, I'm going to teach about this um, new online uh, tool that is called NiceNet ORG. So using this tool, you can create your online classroom. Uh, it is of course, when you compare to remaining uh, tools like Ubuntu and Edmodo in the same kind of things, I hope. And just to, what you have to do, just to go to the uh, web browser, just you have to type uh, NiceNet www dot uh, nice net dot org just type it you need for this particular platform you don't require any uh, you need not download anything it is it runs on online here just you click uh, the new user start here just you teachers create a class just you give create a class you have to create your username for example I'm I'm giving us uh, RK R current password also I am giving same thing R current class name first year BE and I am giving my email ID and I am confirming the email ID also come and uh, this is optional only but anyhow let me give my name so the same thing you have to do and just you give create class remember password just to give not now wait for a moment it is loading and I think after some time you'll be able to see your class yeah now what you have to do, you have to uh, save, save your username and password. Your username is, I have given us our current and class key. This is very important because your students will be able to access your class only after entering this class key. So just note down AD973MW86. Okay. And uh, save the key now. Uh, a copy of key also, it has been sent to our mail address also. And after that, give finish registration. And uh, now you can log into the thing. Same, I think you, you hope you remember the username. What is that? Yeah, our current. And uh, password we have given the same. Our current. Log into ICA. Yeah, see that in the home page here your class name will appear these are the uh, things you can uh, use this see conferencing links having documents class schedule schedule and class members see this class members will be you now you will not find anything because you have not given this uh, to any students so first let me tell you what is conference just click that just you can add any it's a kind of a discussion topic you can give uh, banning ban of Ambedkar Ambedkar studies in IIT your opinion just you can give like this your opinion about one of from the studies in IIT just to give add topic so you can even you have created the you are the administrator of the class even you can create a, uh, what you call a, it's good or bad you can register opinion just I'm saying uh, it is it is not fair you can give title for a comment I don't I do not consider this as it's good just you, you can you can type no there is no limitation you can go just to just a post a message 
so here date limit here you can uh, you can view all means you know on the every day when you start giving after giving this to opening to this the same thing to the class students you will find uh, let's say you say for example you take there are 60 students and each 60 student they will be posting uh, many post about their opinion so here it shows that if you want to do the recent one you can just one year one month one week and last login like that so for 60 student they have posted you can view all the 60 students on students see here from dr rajesh shegran i have given and it's not fair this is my subject code and i don't know can say this could and the major advantage here is you can send a personal message to dr rajesh shegran also that it will it will create more interaction among your class member even as a administrator we can send a personal message to also to that particular student this is one thing and this is about conference you can keep on adding the every week you can post one conferencing topic after that you can keep on adding and you can give right to students also they can also add uh, some other conferencing topic per topic and next one is link sharing so you add a link it's nothing but you know just to create a link to the web uh, automatically uh, here you can have the topics if you want to link name ab dictionary d a c t i o n e r dictionary and uh, you are you are giving that uh, maybe let let us search here google dictionary yeah we'll give this i'll give this as dictionary.reference.com click here for dictionary and the link see here actually uh, the moment they click this for example you click this to state we take to the uh, dictionary mode okay and, and the third one documents the documents uh, actually the moment you post uh, some kind of for example just to add a document just to click it document type or title as is assignment assignment on the link and the copy and paste education in india put a blank between paragraphs okay and here you can uh, it, it needs improvement just i'm typing but here the advantage is you can copy from other word file also you can just you can paste it also just you scroll down create a conference and topic associated with means the same thing it will be there will it will become a conference topic also so we have a document okay now i have uh, it near what you call assignment on women education in india i have given it just improvement so everybody and you can uh, keep on adding this uh, what do you call your document with this and everyone will will, will be viewing this and the clash schedule so you can what do you call that uh, new event even means maybe you even name quiz quiz on virtual it's on virtual classroom just to give it okay and then uh, even start date uh, you remember today is 24 so uh, let me give us 27 sorry first i have to give a month 6 27 15 an option for even taking place over multiple days just will end it at the same date 6 bar 27 into 15 and the screen you can mention all the students 
should take quest should take quest for the year internal component just will give us component component just add a new event suggested even option out of class activities create associated component topic here also the same way you can uh, create a topic oh sorry the end date must be after the start date okay so let me put us 28 now i give add add event Oh, sorry, sorry, sorry. I made a mistake. Twenty-eight. Here I have to give twenty-nine. Now I'm giving add new event. Okay, Dr. Raja, the event has been added to the schedule, the class schedule. Quiz on virtual classroom until June nineteenth. Okay. Now I'm going to uh, show you as a student how to enter the classroom. Got it? And now, Mr. Manak, please do join. Enter the class. You have to. Uh, okay sorry you should not do this again you go to the uh, just to log out uh, username okay and there is no username uh, if you do not have an account joining existing class just to click that and give the class key already we have noted down that is 8d973 M W eighty six. Just click find the class. Again, the same procedure we have to give. Let me give us say car. Oh, for me, I have to give uh, R K uh, B Sheikh. I am giving as my son name and say as a password. Then email. I am giving the same email and. and the same email adle irukku latex theriyum ftp mattum kudukka adle ftp oda idu idu ip 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 mattum kudunga adle varum join the class right it is loading the main thing uh, the student can access this only if they have uh, internet access otherwise it is not possible this will not work uh, offline so or ke abhishek is the user, as a student user name so again we have to give or ke abhishek and again uh, you have to give or ke in the is ka gk and log in to ica the moment you log in yeah the same home first b classes it will appear previously i have shown you the administrator uh, uh, page that is teachers page now i am showing you the student page here and the certain limitations will be here for example uh, let me tell you new link okay here there is no both are the same thing so anybody can if you want to restrict you can restrict in the administrator page i didn't restrict that so it it comes as it is as all the options as available uh, to the administrator it comes to the students also so same thing for example he goes to the conference just uh, he has to click she already and ambedkar sri iit and one ma message posted document one message is passed uh, totally so again i am i am clicking the post i am saying that uh, no it is it is it is right no sensitive issue to be allowed just i'm giving just giving it as a student now you can see that with my name that is now i have uh, included as a student r k abhishek now you can see that see look at here 
RKB, it is right, no sensitivity to be allowed, it, it you can see everything. See the major advantage of this thing is it's so simple as simple and like a same kind of classroom, you can manage the whole thing. I, I think you got the point. Let me quickly sum up, uh, you have to go to the nicenet.org, go there and register as, a, as, as teacher, create your classroom, after that uh, uh, creating your username and password after giving your uh, name, first name and second name all those stuff then you will be uh, you will get to come some kind of a class key that you have to note down you give your class key name also you have to give your name for your class it can be anything maybe straight away you can give, give first year ece uh, 2015 batch or whatever you want you can give after that uh, just to you, you you can you know, log out you can in that there are mainly uh, five options available one is conferencing second one is link sharing third one is document fourth one is class schedule so sorry only four in this four option conferencing you can create a discussion topic and a link sharing you can create a link for any existing net file where they will be they'll be they'll not go on search quickly so you can create a kind of search page the major thing is simply you can as I already posted dictionary you can ask the students also to create a more links so the student will search many other dictionaries also they can uh, post all the links in such a way so if a 60 student post 60 links so you'll get them, the resource will be high in the same kind of documents also uh, in the document probably mainly you can use for the assignment purpose so in the class schedule you create assignment topic ask the student you post that uh, assignment in the document area it will be good and class schedule you can mention about your class all those stuff i hope this will be the useful thing